Hey, so maybe you're interested in tax lien investing, or maybe you're just looking for some information about what the heck tax lien investing is. Well, you're at the right place because this is Ted Thomas, and he knows a little a little tour about this business. We've been talking, Ted. What? Why do you? Why do you like this? How did you get into this whole tax lien investing? Well, I was fortunate to discover this business um, uh, 30 years ago. It's been around for 200 years, but I kind of ignored it. I just did, you know, but it's, everything that I talk about is, is 200 years old. But 30 years ago, I discovered that there was a business where there's millions of properties in the United States and a small amount of people don't pay their tax. Now, if they don't pay their tax, well, then the local county has a problem. So regular traditional real estate, what are you doing today? They have houses they, they're selling, they have vacant land, sometimes vacant residential land they're selling. They're selling small apartments, office building. All right, that's regular real estate. But what happens if they don't pay the tax? Well, now it's a whole new ball game. Now the local county has a problem. What's the problem? The problem is if the county doesn't collect the property tax, how are they gonna pay the police department? How are they gonna pay the fire department? How are they gonna pay the county employees? You're getting the idea. So the county says, wait a minute, you didn't pay your tax, so they're gonna slap your hand. They're gonna say, if you didn't pay your tax, they're gonna issue a piece of paper, just a simple piece of paper. Like this piece of paper, this is a tax certificate. This is what it looks like. This is what a tax certificate looks like. All right, they're gonna issue those, and they tell everybody that they issued it. They put it in the newspaper, and they put it up on the county website. Now, anybody can buy that certificate and pay the default in taxes. Now, why would you wanna pay someone else's default in taxes? You say, I don't wanna pay my own tax, let them pay somebody else. <laughs> All right, well, you want to pay the taxes because if someone paid my tax, what they could earn is in Florida, for example, they could get all their money back when I pay, and most people are going to pay. They're not going to lose a house. All right, they're going to pay. When they pay, they have to pay an, up to an additional 18%. Now, if you go to the bank, you're lucky to get 1%. So now you could earn 18%. If you went to Texas, you can make 25%. If you went to Illinois, you can make 36%. So. I love these tax certificates. Now, why do I really love them? Let me tell you this. Nobody's going to believe me, but this is the true deal. All right. The county issued the certificate, the piece of paper, right? They issued it. So that means if I'm now an investor, so let's put our hat on. Now we're an investor. So right. you can't buy them from Ted Thomas. You buy them directly from that county, your county. You buy the certificate from them. They hold the certificate until Ted comes in and pays. When I pay, they're going to call you up. They'll do it on text now. They'll say, send the certificate in. They'll send you all the money you invested, all the money you invested, you get back plus 18%. Is that a good investment? That's pretty nice. I'll say it's That's I really nice. It. So I mess with the government, I get a check back from the government. Now I know what you're thinking. You said, wait a minute, Ted. If they wouldn't pay the government, why on earth would they pay me? I'll tell you why they'll pay you. Because if you own the certificate and you don't get paid, you get the property without a mortgage. I know you don't believe me, but it's the law in all 3,000 counties in the United States. If the person doesn't pay the tax certificate, you get the property without a mortgage. I don't make the rules. I'm just telling you the way it goes. So I, if I'm hearing this correctly, I'm investing in, I'm basically paying the taxes on your house, but that's my investment. And that's working for the city because, or the county or the state, because obviously they need money to run things, the fire department. Right. Uh, and then I'm basically, when you do pay your taxes, it's really coming to me ultimately, plus that 18% or so. And then if you don't do that, I get your house. That's the law in the United States of America. And it's been that way for 200 years. I wow. didn't invest it. I didn't invent it. I just discovered 30 years ago. I said, wait a minute. What are they going to do if I can buy, if I can, you know what happens? If you raise your hand like I'm doing now, you buy that certificate, you go home and you pray that they don't pay. Why? If they don't pay, you get the property you for just 1% of back taxes. How would you like to have a property for 1%? Hey, this this, this sounds this sounds kind of interesting, Ted. And let me, if the folks watching you want to hear more about this, what's the best way? What's their next step? Easiest thing always to do is uh, when you're watching me, folks, uh, I have a website. It's called tedthomas.com. Simple as that. And uh, we'll show you tons of stuff there, lots of videos and whatever. Great. You might want to head there right now. Again, that's tedthomas.com. Check it out. And uh, we're going to talk some more here. And uh, you're going to get a chance to learn some more when you watch some of those videos. So check it out.